Principal Football hits the gridiron next Monday, and Matt mm -hmm. and Julie are joined by Coach Bobby Petrino for our live interview. That's right. Good morning, everybody, and good morning, Coach. Good Thanks morning. for being with us this oh, you morning. Bet. Got an upcoming season starting with the first practice this week. One week from today oh, we get started today, you know, get on the 31st, so our, our players are excited about it. Talk to us about getting a new team together and kicking off the season. Well, they work hard all winter long, you know, and then we bring in the new freshmen in the summertime. So they continue to lift weights and condition and go out and throw and catch the ball on, on their own. Uh, so the first official practice starts a, a week from today. We'll give them a little bit of break coming up and uh, get going. Okay, Coach, cool. tell us a little bit too about since spring game, who do you think or who do you anticipate has made the biggest leap in development and what do you anticipate this year uh, from maybe some of the lesser known players from last year or the some that we, we do know about? Yeah, I think the interesting part will, will be who our new skill players will be because we did lose some production from the wide receivers and, and running backs that graduated. Uh, we anticipate at wide receiver Jalen Smith and Seth Dawkins to do a great job for us. And then at running back, we're going to move Reggie Bonifon there uh, full-time. And between him and Malik Williams and, and Jeremy Smith, we think we'll have a, a very good group at running backs. Lamar Jackson coming back, Heisman Trophy winner, of course. Uh, the national media, though, isn't hyping him up as much as Heisman Trophy's winners in the past. So you know, what's your reaction to that, and how are you guys handling that? Well, I think what Lamar does so well is he just focuses on playing football. He loves to practice. He likes working out. He really enjoys hanging out with his teammates, and he's, a, he's the ultimate teammate. Uh, so he'll just focus on getting better each week in practice and going out and doing what quarterbacks have to do to allow us to win, which is move the ball and, and get it in the end zone. And, you know, last year at this time, Lamar didn't have any thoughts in his mind about, I'm going to go out and win the Heisman Trophy. Uh, he just wants to go out and play well and, and win games. And Coach, uh, you know, asking about the season schedule and stuff, not only based off of Lamar and the possibility for a repeat Heisman perhaps, but, you know, Deshaun Jackson, uh, is, or Deshaun uh, Watson rather, is out of, the, uh, out of the league and in the NFL, as is uh, Mitch Trubisky. And uh, how did you think that affects the, the overall, when I mean, talking about the ACC conference, is it to a point now where talent level is just reloading? Or do you think that maybe those are some teams that, you know, others, perhaps even the Cardinals, too, will be gunning for a little more than, than last year? Well, each year there's good players that move on and move on to the NFL from the ACC conference. And uh, one of the things about the ACC is everybody has very good players and they're really well coached. So each week's going to be a, a really come down to the fourth quarter, whether you're going to win or lose. Right now, what we've focused on in the offseason is really just our first three games working hard, getting ready for Purdue, which is our opener up in Indianapolis. And then we got to go on the road and play a, a very good North Carolina team. Uh, but they will have a new quarterback. And then we have Clemson at home. So it's a, it's a great start uh, to a season, and we're real excited about it. You know a lot of fans are going to look forward to Clemson. And then they, they, they probably, unlike you, Coach, I know, but they'll probably jump ahead of that game at Florida State. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, I don't even know what the date on that one is yet. We can only focus on, you know, the first three. To, to Really, that's how you spend your offseason. You, you look at three games each year that you're going to really study and get ready for. And certainly those are three big games early in the year. Right. And that first game, September 2nd against Purdue. By the way, we want to let you know that the Cards play Kentucky. November 25th, that game will be played in Lexington. Good luck to you this season, Coach. Thank you very much. I appreciate it.